Hello everyone. This next leg on our journey will be from Skiafos in Greece to uh, Antalya in Turkey. But first, I would like to speak a little bit more about this airport. The runway are uh, characterized as short and narrow and uh, the pilots uh, have to undergo special training uh, in order to land here. And uh, it's only the, the captains that are allowed to uh, perform the landing. Skiafos is often called the Greek St. Martin because uh, it's a great plane spotting place. Uh, the planes uh, fly very low to the ground and uh, t over a beach just as uh, St. Martin. And the largest aircraft uh, that have ever used the airport was a Boeing 767-200 um I don't know how they managed to uh, to take off but uh, apparently they did we are ready for departure and uh, some flights uh, that are departing from Skafos uh, for a long journey as uh, for Britain for example uh, cannot take sufficient fuel to complete the whole trip so they have to uh, make a stop at the uh, Thessaloniki International Airport I hope I pronounced that right uh, the only plane that's actually able to carry enough fuel to Britain is the Boeing 757. And as for our departure, we didn't get an SID. We did get a direct to uh, Sierra Alpha Kilo and uh, make uh, the right turn after we have passed 2000 feet and uh, then climb initially to uh, flight level 270 let's talk about our uh, destination uh, for today uh, Antalya in uh, Turkey uh, the airport has three runways which is parallel to each other uh, and uh, there is one left, one center and one right and uh, the length is uh, approximately 11,000 feet and uh, one is uh, around 10,000. The airport can accommodate a lot of passengers uh, unlike the Skiafos with uh, <laughs> two parking spots uh, this airport uh, has two international terminals and one domestic and are accommodating uh, around uh, 25 million Air passengers uh, per year. Turning base for runway uh, left. We didn't expect an ATC to be online, so we choose an ILS for runway 36 right, the Ergin 1 Echo arrival. When the ATC came online, Atis told us to use uh, 18 left localizer. So I changed to the localizer approach for 18 left and then I got words from uh, ATC to switch to an ILS approach but uh, as I was getting closer to the approach and with all the charts loaded into my EFB I requested the, the localizer approach for runway 18 left. Continue. Check. Minimums. Air Charles 7917, uh, runway 18 left vacated on Sierra. This is 7917, welcome to Antarctica, sir. Thank you for watching your leg number two of our journey around the globe. And uh, the next destination um, we haven't decided yet, so uh, it will be a little surprise. I hope to see you next time and have a nice day. Bye bye. Yes. Captain, all slides are disarmed. Thank you very much.